All right, we have Kate here. We're going to start talking about some of the components for the events on Saturday at Icebreaker. We're going to start here with the clean ladder. You'll have a series of bars. There's only one bar here, but you'll have a series of bars all lined up so that all you have to do is progress through the ladder. The first thing, if Kate's going to go, she has hit her, she has hit her five box jumps. So with a two-footed takeoff, that would not work. Go back down. Two foot of take off, you don't get to take a step. There you go. And then locks her hips out the top. So she hits her five, then she can move on to the bar. So let's see some things where that won't, won't be good. Hop on down, Kate. Don't stand tall at the top. Okay, jumping up, that doesn't work. Like that with one leg. Now not open your hips. Or jumping up and trying to open your hips as you jump off. Let's see what that looks like. That won't work either. You got a two foot of jump and land. Hips open, that's one. All right, hop on down, Kate. You knock out five of those, and in the time remaining, you can clean that weight and then press it overhead. You press it over to however you like. It's gonna end, though, with your hips, knees, ankles, arms, everything's locked out, feet brought together. So the weight has to be overhead, and you bring it back down, and you're good. Put the weight back down, Kate. Then you can move on to the next rung of the ladder. You'll have 10 seconds to transition, so you and your partner are with the next rung, and the people behind you can go and start the, the rung behind you. Now, some questions. Let's say Kate can't do the next weight. Her partner can take over for her. So it's Kate's turn. She knocks out the five box jumps. She can't hit the weight. The partner hits the weight. But going forward, since she didn't hit the weight, Kate's now out. She can't do anything. The partner has to hit everything from that point forward. The clean, the next round of box jumps, that clean, the next round of box jumps, and that clean. We'll go over all this again, but that's the one component. One person can leave their partner behind, the partner can't complete it. Once the second partner can't complete it, then you're done. The score is the weight that was completed for that team. So if they get to 205, that scores 205. If they get to 135, the score is 135. 